What's up, Internet? You know what really turns me on? Strippers practicing their awesome moves. Boink! To the head! What's up guys? I wanted to talk about Westboro Baptist Church. They were recently protesting uh, Jews, because apparently God hates Jews too. Anyways, Brooke Stone was there, and I got a link in the doobly-doo down below. The video's hilarious. They're bashing everybody, and he's asking them questions, and... I guess whoever started Westboro Baptist Church has good charisma, and I think he's kind of funny. He must be. Because whoever started them can't be serious. There's no way. Somebody found a bunch of idiots. Their collective IQ is about that of a peanut and has them doing stupid shit. Like, they're out there saying God hates gays, yet they've got the most fruity faggot signs I've ever seen in my life. Their signs are like 64 colors and they're wearing like blue and pink and purple. You're going to bash gay but have a gay sign. Anyways... Pretty much they hate everybody, but he's out there interviewing them, and uh, one of the, they do like music video parodies and stupid crap, because they can't sing. Like one of them's a Lady Gaga parody, and they're singing that God hates Lady Gaga, and it's just really bad and awkward. I, I don't know. But they're talking to that girl, and she's like, well, God hates Lady Gaga. She's a dyke. And the Brick's like, uh, doesn't she have a penis and the girl's like uh i don't know when and he's like wouldn't that make it not gay and she's like uh no and he's asking him like does double anal count and all this shit anyways i got the link down below it is hilarious check it out recently in a hotel room in atlanta there was a four-year-old boy who found a used condom and put it in his mouth he now has an infection in his mouth and they could possibly be suing the hotel chain i can imagine his dad now Boy, I told you not to put stuff in your mouth. Now you got herpes. Little boy's like, Daddy, you never say that. Quit talking back, son, or you're going to catch gonorrhea. Wrinkle, you can get geeky. Mm -hmm. I was like, funny. Rachel, you could tell, was recently in the news saying she'd give up everything to get back with Tiger Woods. Give up everything? Really? $10 million is what you'll give up? Considering the divorce he just had was $600 million? I bet you would give up everything to get back with him. You'd love to have that money. You seem to have a thing for rich guys. You're kind of a gold digger. And he apparently likes hooking up with a bunch of hoes. So, obviously, it's a pretty good bet that you'll get to take some of his money. He's not taking you back. Look at all the girls he was hooking up with. That man is partying. He just recently shot his best game of golf right after getting divorced. He's back in the hot seat. You're in the hoe seat. This is Brandon Brown, and that's all the shit I got to talk about today.